co-founder and artistic director of The Living Theater, Judith Molina. I'd like to read you uh, two anarchist poems. One is a 12-line poem uh, that I wrote many years ago on which I based a play that we're now performing at the Living Theater called Korach, <clears throat> as is this poem. Korach. We are the children of Korach, whose sin was so grave that the Holy One opened the earth to swallow even his wives at his tent pole. Not for Cain, who slew his brother, nor for David, who slew his thousands, did the Holy One decree such retribution. Only for him, who slew no one, but declared the heresy, we are all holy. <laughs> Beware of the law of the land. As long as the struggle continues between the unyielding man and the pliant female yearning, those who find reasons to hate will hate me because I am a Jewish woman who wrestles with the language that calls the Holy One He. Wrestles like a female Jacob wrestling with a testicled angel for the sake of the pure word that ungenders holiness. As long as there's competition, someone somewhere will win, and someone will be a loser, and there the cycle of envy and fear has already begun to play itself out somehow, somewhere. Chavarim. If we were chosen at all, uh, we were chosen to suffer and teach. History shows us abundant suffering and teaching and taking the heat. As long as there's a sacrifice in the temple or in the butcher shop, infringing the thou shalt not kill with a hundred interpretations, Someone will die. Someone will cry that the matzahs are made of blood. And they will herd us again into the synagogue at Seville or Toledo for the immolation, for the burning of the Jews. When I first heard it said that the Jews killed Jesus, I asked my father, the rabbi, how could this be? And he said, it was a Jewish custom under Roman rule, a Jewish country, and a Jewish court. He was tried by the law of the land, a Jew among Jews. I was aghast. I thought, beware of the law of the land. As long as there's a weapon, there will be hatred of Jews. And the sanctification of the name will seep in between the cobblestones with a scarlet stench from the veins. As long as we put our trust in punishment and punitive law, some Jew somewhere will be nailed up Beware of the law of the land. Come on, Chaverim. It's time for the evening prayer.